Today I want to talk to you about my friend Rick and probably the most powerful lesson that in my life that I have learned that came from him. Um, it didn't come from words or anything he said. It came from just him being who he is. Um, and anyone that knows him, uh, you understand what I'm talking about. So Rick passed away in December 2022 after a seven-year battle with two different forms of cancer. And during that time, you know, I saw it took his breath, it took his hair, um, but he was always loving and wonderful with people. And I think probably the biggest thing that I learned from his struggle, he never lost his faith. Not one time. You know, he never got angry with God. Or Blame God for his cancer. There's such a profound lesson in that. He stayed true to who he was. He stayed true to his faith. He's been through some very dark times. He was at peace the whole time. And, you know, that lesson, honestly, has carried me through. You know, I had a stroke last year and lost my voice completely. I've been out of work for a year. And at any other point in my life, I would be so frustrated and so upset and so angry, but I'm not because of Rick. In the example he said, you know, there is nothing in this life, in this world, that could separate you from the love of God. And if you believe and if you have faith, Everything's going to be okay in the end. It's taken me a long time to be able to talk about it. But I know I needed to talk about it because he made me promise while he was still around that I wouldn't just sit on things and keep things bottled up uh, and let things eat at me over time. You know, I suffered for many, many years after my grandfather passed away, who was one of the biggest rocks in my life. Sometimes I still struggle with it, if I'm being honest. I think it's only human. Um, but he wanted me to carry on, uh, and he wanted me to take the lessons that I've learned and apply them to others. He wanted to make sure that no matter how tough times got, and they've been really tough, that I'm still ready and willing and able to share my light with others and to keep loving and believing. And I can never, ever repay Rick for the lessons that he taught me. And... I hope that you have someone in their life that's teaching you lessons like that. And I know I'm emotional, and I know this brings tears because I miss Rick terribly. But I know he's in a better place now with no pain. And I know he's smiling down that 
I haven't given up. I haven't given in. That even if it's taking one step forward, crawling one inch forward every day, I know that he would be proud of that. And I have gone a year without telling my story. And it's one thing that's really eat me up inside. But I can't let evil win. I can't give up. And I can't let me be silenced and my story to go untold. I have to do this. I needed to need to help others and to share my light uh, and to give hope. And, boy, if you knew everything that I've been through in my life, I would hope it would give you strength and, you know, faith that everything's going to be okay. Um, It's hard to see that in the midst of the storm uh, with everything life throws at you. It's really hard sometimes to get get by. Um, but you just got to hang in there and believe and have faith and everything will be okay. So thank you, Rick, for the lessons you taught me. I will never forget you.